Hey guys, so sorry about the really weird angle and environment today, um, and I look like crap, sorry, um, and it's a little bit late, uh, the video's late, and it's late in the day, um, it's about 11pm, and I'm just getting ready for bed, uh, my husband is on a night shift tonight, and we're in, uh, I'm in my bedroom right now, I'm in my husband's bedroom, um, just, uh, yeah, making my 20 eight week video quickly before I go to sleep. Um, I just got back from uh, a client appointment. It was uh, my final antenatal session with her until she goes into labor and she's due in um, just just over a month. Um, so that was really good. I just uh, you know taught her husband some massages that he can do for her now and during labor and uh, things that he can do to help her during contractions. She has uh, sacroiliac joint dysfunction, which is kind of uh, the opposite of um, SPD. It's uh, the back ligament in the pelvis being a little bit, pelvis being a little bit wonky. Oh, I'm out of breath even laying down. Um, but yeah, guys, I'm in the third trimester now, which, um, kind of as daunting as it is, it's almost a relief, because I feel like the second trimester went on forever for me, um, and I feel like I'm progressing now, um, yeah, bump, I don't know if you guys can see the full bump now, um, and I'm definitely feeling it, it seems like as soon as I hit third trimester this past weekend, I automatically started to slow down. Um, I, uh, my cousin from Israel is still in town for another few days, and I went out with her the other day to take her around London, and, um, I had to turn around to go back home because every few steps I started to get really, really faint, and, um, that was just a, a one-off thing, it seems, but... Um, yeah, if I'm too hot, then I get faint and uncomfortable and I feel nauseated. And now if I'm on my feet for too long, they start to swell. Um, really getting puffy in the face and I'm noticing my arms getting bigger too. Um, telltale signs of things coming down to the wire, just generally getting puffier and chubbier. Chubbier still. Um don't want this to go too long. Uh, about three minutes, okay. Um, but yeah, I'm really starting to feel it. I'm tired. I haven't managed to exercise this week at all. Part of that is because my cousin is here and I haven't really, um, had the time to take to myself to exercise because that would be rude. Um, but I've also been feeling so fatigued that I'm not sure I'd be able to exercise. Um, but really, I think part of it is that because I haven't exercised this week, my energy levels have gone down, so my energy levels are usually higher when I exercise consistently. Um, but yeah, I'm going to get back into working out once she, uh, once she leaves. I had my 28-week uh, midwife appointment today, at 28 weeks in one day. And um, she was going to do routine blood work, but she forgot her tourniquet. And... Um, offered to use a latex glove instead, which used to be done. It's kind of old school and um, supposedly, unsurprisingly, really, really painful. So I said no, and she's going to come back in the morning instead to do the blood work. Um, but everything else is fine, really. Um, growth is good. Baby's active and his heart rate was good. Um, the only weird thing is that there was still a little trace amount of protein in my urine. Um, if you're a new subscriber, uh, thanks for subscribing and welcome. I had a UTI a few weeks ago, and um, there was a trace amount of protein in my urine that week, but that could just be a result of the existent bacteria there. But um, since I believe the UTI has cleared up, I was surprised that there was still a trace amount today. Um, but there doesn't seem to be a need for concern about preeclampsia because I don't have excessive swelling. My blood pressure is very low. It was 100 over 60 
and it's been consistently in that in that ballpark the whole pregnancy. Um, she's not had any headaches, anything like that. So, yeah, it could just be. Uh, who knows? Who knows? Um, I think it's odd, but no, I'm not really worried. Um, what else is going on, you guys? Yeah, I'm pooped out. I'm so tired. Um, I've hardly had the energy to, like, you know, put on real clothes during the day or makeup or anything. I'm totally barefaced now. And in my glasses, which is a telltale sign that I'm tired. Um, yeah, just... Things are getting down to the wire. Um, and I'm really excited. I'm getting to the point where I'm ready to not be pregnant anymore. I kind of, uh, I just want the baby to be here and safe and, uh, to have my normal energy levels back and get back into shape and, uh, be able to do the things that I'm usually able to do. And that's fairly normal coming into the third trimester. It's been a long haul. Um, yeah, what else? Hmm. Yeah, nothing terribly exciting. I could be forgetting stuff just because I'm tired now. It's been a long day. Um. Um. Yeah. I took some bump pictures a couple of days ago, and I will stick them at the end of this video. Um. As of now, I don't think there's anything else really left to report, um, yeah, just getting bigger, uh, I got a little depressed the other day after seeing some recent pictures of myself, I just, uh, I feel like I look so, so overweight, like, some people tell me that I'm all bump, um, but I really see a difference everywhere, um, so, yeah, I hate to be worrying about my weight during my pregnancy, but I am. Um, so yeah, I've been a little depressed about that. My husband has been so good about telling me that I'm beautiful and, um, you know, sorry if this is TMI, but sex is still great and it hasn't declined at all. I think, if anything, my husband is even more handsy and enthusiastic now than before I was pregnant. Um, but yeah, so I'm trying to keep my my self-esteem up, really, and not feel too bad about gaining weight, because I know, I know I'll lose it all, and then probably then some, uh, once the baby comes. I'm getting kicked right now. I'm gonna have to try to put up a, a belly movement video. I'll film that with my flip. I'm using my webcam now. I have a MacBook and a little camera attached to the computer. But yeah, I'll use my flip and I'll try to get a um, a belly movements video up for you guys because that would be fun. Because um, you can definitely, definitely see movement now from the outside. This started quite a, you know, about a month ago. So I'll try to get that up. Um, yeah, I'm trying to watch what I eat since I don't have it in me really to exercise as much as usual. So I'm trying to cut out processed sugar and I've gone a couple days now without it. Though I'm letting myself have a couple of squares of dark chocolate a few times a week because that um, keeps me from wanting to binge and relapse. But yeah, like no cookies or cake or ice cream, nothing like that. Just a uh, loads of fruit, and then if I really, really am fiending for something, I'll have a square of dark chocolate. I specifically really, really like, um, this one called Bourneville. I think it might be Cadbury, I'm not sure. Like, for those of you in the UK, it comes in a red wrapper, and it is the best dark chocolate. I don't know what it is about it. <laughs> um, I discovered it at the very beginning of when I started my nursing training. And it's a godsend for, for some reason, um, something about this chocolate, um, if I have like a little tiny bit every day, it totally takes care of any desire I have for junk food. And, um, 
it completely enables me to to eat better. I don't know. It's good stuff. I recommend it. Um, I'm rambling now. Uh, yeah. Third trimester. Starting to think about labor. Um, and just the fact that I'm two-thirds through the pregnancy now. And, uh, my husband and I are going to be parents sooner rather than later. Um, crazy, crazy. So yeah, I'm sorry this has been a completely weird and spaced out vlog, everyone, but I'm, I'm tired and I didn't want this video to be too late, so I just thought I'd get it in quickly and tell you guys what I could off the top of my head. Um, and... I promise next week's video will be <laughs> more interesting and a little bit longer uh, and not quite as space cadet disorganized blah 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 so yeah I'll put in the bump pictures now and talk to you guys for week 29. Bye!